Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Curtis Institute of Music. My name is J.P. Altizer, and I'm the Director of Patron Relations. On behalf of all of the performers tonight, I'd like to thank you for joining us. Sharing the magic of a live performance is a part of what makes studying at Curtis so special, and we're all grateful that you've chosen to spend your evening with us tonight. A few items before we begin. If you haven't already done so, you can scan the QR code at the entrance to Field Concert Hall for tonight's program. And also, now is a great moment to ensure that your phone is either turned off or on silent. The first piece on tonight's program is by Nadia Boulanger, who is a French music teacher and conductor who educated many of the 20th century's leading musicians and composers. In addition to composing, she is also known for being the first woman conductor of many major symphony orchestras, including the Philadelphia Orchestra, where she premiered pieces by Copland and Stravinsky. Some have called Antonio Vivaldi the pioneer of the bassoon concerto. He's thought to have written the first solo concerto for a bassoon before writing 38 more. Scholars believe that these pieces were written for an especially talented young orphan who resided at a music conservatory for all women in Venice at the time. And then finally, known as the Mozart of flute, Francois Devienne was the first flute faculty at the Paris Conservatory after he spent some time in the French Guard as a sergeant teaching the military band there. His compositional output consists primarily of wind pieces, and his bassoon quartets are among the best representation of wind music of the era, showcasing the instrument's brilliance in a refined and elegant way. Once again, I'd like to thank you for joining us. I'll be outside the hall after tonight's recital and would love to get to meet you, hear about your favorite piece, and answer any questions you might have about Curtis. Thanks.
Hi everyone, thank you so much for coming tonight and um, uh, thank you so much uh, to also my colleagues who are amazing, like wonderful musicians and I feel really lucky to play with them. So thank you all for being here. Um, so these four years have in Curtis have been a really incredible learning experience. Um, it's also been challenging, of course, but um, I remember four years ago, I just, I was standing right here for my Curtis audition, and I remember um, I was so nervous and just scared and <laughs> everything. And so to be able to stand here today as a completely different person and um, a more mature musician, um, I definitely couldn't have done it um, without so many people who have always been by my side supporting me. Um, so I want to say thank you to a lot of people. Um, first of all, thank you to my parents. Thank you to my mom. Um, she flew all the way from Taiwan to be here. So thank you for being here. <laughs> thank you, um, mom, for always encouraging me to be my own, like my own person and to find my own way. And for always being by my side, um, like support, supporting me in the most difficult situations and times, like for example, like the time I thought I didn't pass the finals of Curtis four years ago. <laughs> um, and I want to uh, thank my dad also, who's like watching the live stream right now, even though it's super early in Taiwan. <laughs> um, I want to thank my dad for always being so incredibly supportive of me and for always believing in me even though, even when I didn't believe in myself. And also for always reminding me to be positive and to look on the bright side. Um, I also want to thank my teacher, Mr. Matsukawa. Um, thank you so much for your support and your teaching throughout these four years. Um, I'm really grateful that uh, I'm super grateful for your commitment to teaching and uh, the fact that you have so much care for your students. I've grown so much under your help and I feel very lucky to have such a teacher who truly cares for me and wants the best for me. So yeah, and thank you for teaching me how to be not only a better bassoonist, but a better musician and a better person. Thank you. Thank you. I also want to thank my first teacher, um, who is probably also watching the live stream, um, Yishu Chen. Thank you for seeing something in me um, in my first lesson and for believing in what I didn't know I could be. And you'll always be my ins inspiration. I'm so lucky that I have a teacher like you. And next, I, <laughs> I would like to thank my partner, um, my best friend, and also a bassoon colleague, Luis, um, he's not here, but he's watching the live stream. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to stand here today um, without you and your constant support and encouragement throughout these past years. Um, you've helped me so much through my musical journey, and you've taught me to grow and never give to never give up. And in in the hardest moments, you were always there. Um, Whenever music becomes like a little too stressful, you know, you are always there for me and to hold me. And you truly are my inspiration in every way. Thank you so much, Luis. <laughs> also, I want to shout, shout out my studio <laughs> because uh, thank you so much, guys, for being like the chillest and like a fun group of people, and I feel very lucky to such, uh, to have um, these last two years to have the opportunity to um, play with you guys and to learn from you guys. Thank you so much. Um, I also want to thank um, my Curtis friends, who I feel very honored to have learned from and to get to know, and who've, who's always been so supportive of me as well. Um, and lastly, I want to thank all my teachers, my friends, and my family um, in Taiwan and also in the States. And of course, thank you so much everyone for being here today. Um, and I hope that you enjoy 
um, our last piece, which is the Devian. Um, it's really fun. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Thank you. 